Appreciate the $5 super chat. Uh, Mitsukid says, hey, are you going to do an Emotiva RMC1 video update with Dirac? No. Um, probably not. Um, I just, I reviewed that, the RMC1. It's been a while. Um, so they sent it to me when they first introduced it. I had a lot of bugs with it. Hopefully by now, I mean, it's been a long time. Hopefully they've gotten those bugs worked out, but um, from what I've heard, they don't, they definitely don't have all of them worked out, but um, so I don't have any plans of like, cause here's the reality. When I get a, a product in for review, especially electronics, you know, um, they send me whatever they're going to send me. A lot of times it's before or right at the launch. Mm -hmm. And so sometimes, I mean, I guess my thought is every, and this is for every company, not just Emotiva, every company. I would want to make, if I was a company, I would want to make sure this thing is in the very best condition performance that it possibly can be before I send it out to the world. And that's both content creators and reviewers like myself, somebody that's going to be measuring these, you know, like Audioholics, somebody that's going to purchase this like a consumer. Let's try to get these things right out the gate so that we don't send it out and go, okay, you guys let us know what you find out. And we'll fix it along the way. Um, so, but I could do that with literally every product. I could do that with the sofa baton remote that I received. It was really buggy. And some people said, Hey, are you going to review the new one? I mean, I, dude, I got, I got more stuff in the theater room that I can, <laughs> I mean, I, and this is all new stuff. So it's hard to just go back and, and review something again, because I'm going to say a lot of the same things other than, okay, it works now, or I didn't run into these issues, or I still ran into some of these issues. So it just, I don't know. I, I'm not sure I see a ton of value. I'd rather another content creator that hasn't reviewed that product to get it in. Mm -hmm. let's, let them kind of say, I agree. Oh, here's what I feel. Here's what I've experienced. Here's where it's at in its current state and just kind of let them do that. Or if you had the RMC one already and you were Correct. reviewing it and doing sure. the update. Absolutely. So if I owned it and I did all the updates that they had, you know, added and, um, you know, and I'm not experiencing it, of course I could say, yeah, I mean, here we are six months past. This thing is performing a lot better. I don't run into these issues and, you know, they've, they've fixed those. But like I said, hopefully by now, I mean, it's been a long time. It's probably been two years or longer. So I would really hope that any company after two years could, could get some firmware updates to fix, you know, yeah. any bug issues that they were, they were incurring there. 